Hey guys, welcome back. Today I wanted to share with you my March Bath & Body Works empty. So I don't have as much as the previous months, but I still have some products so I thought I would share them with you anyway. Um, the first is the Juicy Georgia Peach Nourishing Hand Cream. I love their hand creams. I've talked about them many times before. Um, this scent was just okay to me though. Yeah, it was just like a fresh peach scent. Um, my favorite scent in their nourishing hand cream line is the vanilla buttercream one. I love that one. Um, and they just came out with a new hand cream. Um, so I'm interested in trying that one. So this formula is definitely one I, I would repurchase. I don't know about the scent though. It was just okay to me. I mean, I enjoyed it, but I really like the vanilla buttercream one and I'm interested in those new ones. I have one pocket back. This is the sweet as strawberries pocket back. I liked this one. I really like fruity or floral scents for the pocket backs because I just feel like they smell clean. And this was an artificial strawberry scent, but it was nice. So this is definitely one I would purchase. And I thought the packaging was really cute on it. I bet this is one that they still have because I just bought this, I don't know, maybe a month or so ago. Next is a trial size shower gel in Magic in the Air. Oh, I hated this, hated this, hated this, hated this. Um, it's very like musky smelling. And I just was kind of expecting something more floral, you know, um, but yeah, it's very musky. I did not care for this at all. It was used like once or twice on my body, decided I hated it, and then it got sent to the bath for a bubble bath. So would definitely not recommend or purchase that scent. And then last I have two lotions. So the first is the Ultra Shea Body Cream in Beach Nights Summer Marshmallow. I, along with everybody else, went crazy when this scent came out. Um, I love marshmallows, um, like the marshmallows in general, eating them and the fragrance of them. So I was really, had good high hopes for this. I just didn't really like it. It's marshmallow, but there's something else to it. Um, I don't know what the notes are. They... This packaging is really nice. It's really pretty because it has the picture on both sides, but they don't have a nose for this one. I just didn't care for this line really at all. It definitely smells like marshmallow, but there's something else to it that makes it kind of like that summer marshmallow. I didn't care for it, so I bought the trio of this, and I finished this and the shower gel, so I just have the fragrance, fragrance mist left. Um, but this is not a scent I would repurchase. I just was not into it as a lot of other people were. And then the last product, I still have probably one use left in this, but I wanted to talk about it anyway because I'm going to get rid of all this stuff. So I thought I would um, get rid of this too. So this is the Aloha Waterfall Orchid Body Lotion. Um, I don't like their body lotions whatsoever. I think they're too thin. Um, I don't think they're moisturizing. So... Whenever I get things like this, like I got this in my stocking at Christmas time. So whenever I get things like this, they go straight into the shower and I use these as shaving um, cream to shave my legs. So right after Christmas, the, that day it went into my shower and I've been using it to shave my la legs ever since. And I probably shave my legs at least two if not three times a week. Um, so this has lasted me quite a long time. Um, but I like it for shaving my legs. So my legs are super like dry and sensitive, I guess, because whenever I shave my legs, I immediately have to get out of the shower and put on lotion, like immediately. Um, I can't like wait around too long because my legs burn really badly and my legs still burn when I use this, but it's a lot less. I can like take time to actually dry off and get out of the shower before I would be rushing to like I had lotion ready to like slather on my legs because it just, it hurts so bad. Um, and it's not the razor. I've changed razors. It's just, I just have sensitive legs, but this is moisturizing enough that it kind of gives me a few extra minutes to like get to the lotion stage of my like after shower routine. Um, the scent didn't really care for, um, dewy orchid, lush rainwater, Polynesian gardenia, ginger lily blossom, and island sandalwood. Could not tell you a single thing that's on there. Um, orchid, I don't think that orchids actually smell. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I don't think that those actually have a scent. Um, anyway, this is, it's a really floral scent, not something I would purchase. And I definitely, I don't ever purchase the body lotions. I just use them in the shower like when they come my way. 
So that is that guy. And that is everything that I have used so far. Hopefully next month I'll have a larger empty since I'm kind of working through like a few products that are close to being done, but they're just not quite there yet. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you very soon in my next one. Bye.